So I'm gonna be hitting the gym right away. I'm gonna be uh, training some arms. I'm just uh, mixing my pre-workout right now. Uh, I usually just drink some Outlift by Nutrex and uh, mix it with some Envane. <coughs> um, for my nutrition right now, because I'm about 205 pounds right now, 205, 206 pounds, depending on the time of the day, um, about 5'9", so that's pretty much the heaviest I've ever been right now. Um, I'm eating about 3,600 calories um, a day. I'm training in the morning uh, and I'm training in the evening. A lot of you guys that follow me on Instagram and Snapchat and Periscope and stuff like that, you know that I normally train in the morning. I train twice a day, but uh, I usually do cardio and some plyometrics in the morning and then a lift in the evening. Uh, I'm no longer doing the cardio in the morning because uh, I want to try to work on some uh, weaker areas. So I'm going to try to bring up my shoulders because I have larger arms. Um, my shoulders are kind of smaller and my arms are more predominant on my physique. And I'm gonna to try to bring up my upper chest. So I'm training twice a week now uh, for my shoulders and twice a week for my chest. Sometimes three times a week if I can. But, um, so yeah, that's kind of how I'm doing my split right now. I'll get more in depth into it uh, in later videos and stuff like that. But for now, that's just kind of what I'm doing right now. I'm hit the gym and uh, get an arm workout in. So I just got to the gym. Uh, it's only like a five minute drive for me, so uh, I'm pretty fortunate that way. Um, I'm a little bit early. I'm meeting my workout partner, Christian. Well, he's a little late. He's usually late, but uh, so I got some time to kill. I got my my phone here and I figured I would answer some uh, questions. I know that you guys ask me a lot of questions and I don't get a lot of time to answer them. So I got three of my number one, or I guess it'd be my top three, uh, ask questions. I don't know why you guys always seem to want to know this, but the person that takes my pictures on Instagram is generally me. Uh, I have a good camera. I set it up and I have a timer and I post my pictures. That ties into my second most asked question, uh, which is how to grow your social media following. Uh, I get this. I get asked this all the time. Um, it's not going to be the exact same for everyone. Um, what works for me might not work for you. What works for me and what I personally believe in is being as real as possible. Um, people can smell bullshit on social media from a mile away. It's pretty easy and in an industry such as myself or such as the fitness industry that myself's in, myself is in, um, there's fucking too much fakeness and too much bullshit uh, already. So just be as real as possible, be you, be genuine, and people will uh, either like you or they won't like you. Um, post good quality pictures and stuff like that. Uh, I have a high definition camera. I shoot my videos in Canon, or I shoot my videos with a Canon 5D, and uh, this video that I'm shooting right now is on a Canon GX7, which is uh, has a flip screen, and it's kind of good for vlogging and stuff like that. So have high quality pictures and stuff like that. People like seeing um, high definition pictures on social media and whatnot. The pictures just come out better. So do that. Um, be as genuine as possible. Know when to post and your um, demograph. So if you have a big following from Australia, your peak time for posting isn't gonna, or, and you're in Canada, your peak time for posting isn't gonna be the exact same as theirs. So figure out their time zones and know when to post um, at the peak times for your following. A thing that I do is I ask, uh, I'll make a post quite often and I'll ask where everyone's from. I don't generally care too, too much about where everyone's from. I'm taking a poll of where my followers are from. Uh, just things like that, that can help uh, grow your following better. <clears throat> Let's see what the number, th what else we got here? I got asked this one a lot too, uh, when did I start training? Uh, I started lifting weights when I was like 12 years old. Obviously I wasn't, lift or I'm, I wasn't lifting weights then, the way I am now, but that's when I started lifting weights. I wanted to get bigger and stronger for football. I had to start football when I was 13. 
So I played football from 13 to 17 in high school, and then uh, I started getting into martial arts uh, and fighting and MMA and competing in Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu competitions. So I've always been athletic, and uh, I've always worked out and lifted weights and stuff like that to stay as functional as possible and athletic as possible for my competitions and sports. And then when I was 25, I'm 27 years old right now, when I was 25, um, I got into the fitness industry and that's when I started lifting almost bodybuilder-ish type working out for men's physique competitions and stuff like that. So I've been working out and lifting weights for 15 plus years, I guess, but uh, pretty seriously probably for the last eight years. So, so I just got to the gym. I'm gonna hit a heavy arm day with uh, Christian, my training partner, who isn't here yet. But uh, I'm gonna warm up right away. And uh, yeah, stay tuned. You guys, uh, let me know how you guys like it.